I'm feeling so emotional. <laughs> Let's draw some emotions, hey? <laughs> that was strange. Hi, my name is Philip and welcome to Totally Amazing. Today, I'm gonna to show you some different tricks on what to do to draw emotions on your face. But today's gonna to be a little bit different because I've actually pre-made something. So for today's video, if you wanna go down to the description, print out the PDF, you can actually follow along as we go on. What we're gonna do is we're gonna show you some basic tips on how to draw a few basic emotions, but then, ha ha ha, this is where the magic comes in. We're gonna mix and match, and you're not gonna believe it. are gonna get so many emotions from just a few little drawings. So let's get down to it, shall we? Okay, so if you'll notice, we've got our pre-made face in. The bits that are missing are the mouth, the eyes, and the eyebrows. The eyebrows are very important when you're trying to get across some emotions. So let's start off with just drawing a fairly neutral face. So we're gonna have a line coming across the bottom here for the mouth. I'm gonna do a neutral anime face. So we're gonna have a little gap in the middle there. Now just draw some basic eyes. There are your basic eyes and just a normal expression on the eyebrows. So just basically side like that. And that's your simple neutral face. Sad face. So this one's going to be more downturned. So we're going to have a curve going down like that with a little, little cleft at the bottom. So he's like, he's really upset. He's, he's, his chin is quivering. Now the eyes, we're going to put our eyes rather big like this. I'm gonna have them sort of facing up a bit, like so. And there's gonna be a tear mark. So I'm gonna have it over the top and the bottom of our line, just like that. See how I've got my eye and the, the tear is going over the top and the bottom. So we're gonna do that on this side as well. Draw our eye, have it a little bit higher. Kind of ready. And then we draw our tear. In there. Now for the sadness of the eyebrows, we're going to have it upturned like this. So we can really exaggerate the eyebrows and that's how we get this sad look. So that's our sad face right there. Alrighty, so now we're going to do more of an angry face. So let's work on the mouth. So we're going to do a sort of a, almost a figure eight shape. Like this, with some teeth marks. And you don't have to go all the way across, you just put a, have it on either side and that's gritting the teeth. Now we're going to do the eyebrows next. So the eyebrows, you basically do a tick, like that. You would on either side. Now the eyes are more narrower, so we're going to have a more of a interned eye like this, and the eyes are usually more closer to the, the actual center of the face, because there's more angry, is more single-minded focus. So there's your angry face. Alrighty, let's work on shocked now. Shocked is more bigger eyes, bigger scares, everything's more exaggerated, like the face is exploding like this. So let's do that. So let's start off with the mouth. So it's gonna be a big O for the mouth. So we draw an O shape over here. Oh my goodness, that is the O shape mouth. So the eyes are gonna be very big. So we're gonna have nice curves up and down like so, and this dot for the center of the eye. That's our shocked eye. So we're gonna do that for the other side as well, for the other side of the eye shocked eyes and the eyebrows as you can probably guess are very high and very open like this so the face is exploding because they can't believe what just happened that's shocked all right this time we're going to do someone who's really excited someone who's really jazzed so let's start with the mouth we're going to have a nice curve at the top for the mouth like this and then we are gonna have a big u shape underneath just like that and we can have the teeth in like that as well or you can even color it in the whole base and there's your mouth for the teeth now for the eyes, the eyes are going to be funny. They're actually going to be sideways V's, like that. So it's all like the eyes are closed and he's really excited and he's having a good time. And we're going to do the same eyes for the excited. So they're going to be quite high and quite open. So that's excited. Someone who's having a really good day. Now let's work on the opposite to excited, bored. Someone who's really bored, uh, that sort of face. So we're going to have a more downward turned mouth and the eyebrows are going to be more narrow and just neutral and blah. So let's work on the mouth. So the mouth we go a curve and it comes up like this. And we can bring the line across. And we can color that in if we want, or we can just leave it like that. Now the eyes, I'm gonna just draw a straight line with a semicircle on the one side. Again, on the other side, straight line, semicircle on the other side. So it's sort of looking that way. He's really uninterested, he's bored. And the eyebrows themselves, very neutral. 
very low, very straight, very bored. That's what the whole face is. It's our bored face. So a good tip to think about is where's the energy when you're looking at the eyebrow? If someone's sad, you're going to just sort of down at this, or if someone's bored, everything's flat, someone's excited, everything's up and bubbly, or someone's shocked, everything's exploding like this. So, oh my goodness, something just happened. Oh my goodness. So that's what you've got to look for. Now we come to the next view. What I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to mix and match some of the faces that we've just done to show you lots of different options that are available for when you're drawing your own faces. So what I've done is I've taken all the faces and I've put them into my program here and I'm going to just flick between them so that makes it a lot easier for you guys to see. Okay, so let's add a smiley face, scared eyes and angry eyebrows. What we get here is more of a crazy joker face. So it's like a crazy person that's really enjoying being mad. So it's a really crazy mad face. So that's sort of maniacal madness. So that's what we get with our angry smiley face. Okay, so let's say your character's been knocked out. So they're knocked out cold. They're like, oh, I've what we'd use here, we'd use an O shape from the shock, but we'd also use the eyes, which were the, the V's from the excited look. And the eyebrows, the eyebrows are going to be high like in shock. Because if you look, the face actually relaxes and goes longer. That's why we use the extended eyebrows. That's, that's our knocked out cold. Let's say someone's wincing. They're like, they just saw someone get kicked really badly somewhere that, that it's not fun to be kicked. So we use the angry mouth for the, the gritted teeth. The eyes are going to be neutral and the eyebrows are going to be high. So that's our... That's our wincing look. Okay, so here we've got concern. So concern, we use the eyebrows from the sadness, which is the upturned eyes. And then we're gonna use the, the bottom of the lip of the sadness. Now the eyes, the eyes are gonna be a bit closed in, so we're gonna be using the angry eyes. That's concern. So here we have sick or in pain. So sick or in pain, you use the mouth from angry, which is the gritted teeth, because you're, you're gritting because you're in pain. But the eyes are going to be the eyes from the excited eyes, because it gives it the look of closed eyes and the gritting. And the eyebrows are also going to be the eyebrows from the sadness, which is the upturned eyes. So that's sick and in pain. What about proud? What if someone's feeling really proud? They've, they've seen someone just really good, and they're just so proud of what their little boy's done. With proud, we use the neutral mouth, and we use the eyes that are crying, so he's welled up, he's really emotional, and the eyebrows of the sadness as well. And this gives us a proud look. Okay, what about confused? Confused, this is interesting. What we're doing here, we're actually mix and matching eyebrows as well. So the eyebrows, one side's gonna be sad, and the other side's gonna be angry. And the eyes are going to be facing to the side like bored, and the mouth is gonna be just the bottom of the, the sad face again. Now this one is over it. Now this is very similar to Confused, but this is someone who's just had enough of what's going on with their day and they are done. So what we're using here, we're using the mouth from board and the eyes from board, but we're also mixing the eyebrows up a bit. So we're gonna have the high eyebrow from shock, but we're also gonna have a neutral eyebrow and that's over it. What about disbelief? This is something like, oh, I can't believe you did that. How could you do that? For this one, what we're going to use here, we're going to use the mouth from board, so it's very open and down but we're going to use the eyes of shock oh my goodness i can't believe you did that and the eyebrows are going to be sad so it's disbelief i can't believe that someone did that what about confident this here is confident so confident we're using the eyes from excited and we're also having a neutral mouth and the eyebrows are actually quite high so we're using the excited eyebrows so this is someone who's had a really good day and they're actually happy with what they're doing what about pouting this is someone who's like want to want to play so what we're going to do here, we're going to use that little extra mouth that I showed you in board, which is the pouty mouth. So they're going to have the little curve and the little curve coming up on the side. The eyebrows are going to be angry. We're going to use the angry eyebrows and we're going to use the angry eyes and that's pouty. Okay, so this one here, this is biting your tongue. This is when someone said something and you know you're not supposed to say anything, but you're really annoyed that that person said something anyway. We're going to use that same pouty mouth, but the eyes are actually going to be a bit larger because they're sort of surprised that there's someone said that and they're really annoyed that they did it too. Plus we're going to be using the angry eyebrows. So that's biting your tongue. So this one's defined. This is when you're having a pissy fit. So what we use for defiant, we use the mouth of board. So it's open and sort of yelling. The eyes are quite open. The eyebrows are very angry eyebrows. And that's what we use for defiant. And finally, we're gonna do cheesy. This is someone's like, <laughs> yeah, I know what's going on, baby. Yeah, this is all good, I got this. Cheesy, we're going to use the mouth from excited, but we're going to use the eyes of excited as well. And the, we're going to mix and match the eyebrows a bit here. So we're going to have one sad eye and the other eyebrow is going to be high like it is in excited. And that's your cheesy look. <laughs> there you have it, some tips on how to draw faces and emotions and expressions. If you got this far, why not leave a comment in below saying mm, banana.
Yeah, that'll show that you got this far. Well done, you. So as you can see, there's so many different combinations that you can come up with. What can you come up with? What other faces do you think you can find by using these mixes and matches of faces? So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hey, why not leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell button, because that's gonna say, hey, I actually enjoyed this. I got something out of it. That's very cool. Also, I have my own comic. It's called Antispire. It's full of amazing magic and adventure, and there's lots of different expressions happening on in there, because people are getting hurt, people are excited. It's great. Links down below, check it out. Other than that, guys, I hope you learned some really cool facial expressions today that you can use in your artwork, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Blooper reel, blooper reel. Prepaid. No, I haven't prepaid any. But, mm. if, I'm gonna work. So to, okay, so. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Give yourself a big smiley face. <laughs>